Hello, welcome to my channel. This is Lisa. And today I want to <clears throat> share a couple bags with you all. So one is what I carried for last week. And then the other one is what I'm moving into. Uh, but I particularly wanted to share this bag with you because <clears throat> it's my first time buying secondhand from eBay, um, a buyer off eBay. The first one I got off of eBay, but it was through I Love Dooney. So it was a brand new bag. Um, but the second one, I really want this bag. Dooney Burke's not carrying it right now. Um, but I really wanted this bag and I found it for a great price on eBay, somebody was selling it, and you know how you do the whole uh, bidding and all that kind of stuff. Well, I did, and I won, and it was a really good deal. One moment. Sorry, I just finished eating. But <clears throat> today is Sunday. I'm just back from church. I haven't been on here in a while, but... Um, I thought I'd come up today because I was feeling it today. So, anyway, this bag is called Hattie. Now, I had been wanting this bag for a very long time, but I just refused. I wasn't paying $500 for a bag. Um, not that I haven't before, but I wasn't sure because I'm really like, I like uh, satchels. I do like hobos, but... I wasn't sure, and I've had, I have some other drawstring bags, a couple other, one with Patricia Nash, and a couple with, um, Dooney and Burke, um, so I, like, do I want to spend that much money on another drawstring bag, but, let me tell you, <clears throat> I bought this one, and it's been a week, and I've been on a roll with changing all my bags every week, and I'm kind of, like, not wanting to get out of this one i've been having fun with it i've been having fun with the color and the reason why i got this color i like this color but okay so ebay had them on i love dooney and they're all like you know marked down to three something which is a really good deal this one in particular this color was like 188 i'm like you know what <laughs> 188 and we all know, as I've said in the past, they don't mind taking your coins if you spend spending 500, 400, whatever. And so I know this could, you know, retail for like 500, over 500. So I said for 188, I got to at least give it a try, right? So I did. And it's the Florentine leather, which is my favorite leather to get out of all of the bags. Um, next, I would say it's the pebble leather, but. Probably that's everybody's favorite, right? But it's the Florentine. And in this color, it's really nice. Like, uh, oh, and it also has the leather on the inside. Which is similar to some other bags I know. But I only have this one with the leather on the inside. And I have this one. Uh, this is a Florentine bag, but I don't know the name of it. Some of you guys are so good. You come on here. I said, do they take notes or... Uh, sorry, I can't. I, don't, I, I barely get on here with a video, let alone like writing all that information down and trying to remember it. But anyway, this is the Florentine. It has a leather on the inside. I put a little charm on it, which normally... Like, I have some charms, but I don't like wear them all the time. I don't know why, because I have fun with this little charm um, on the side of my bag. The... Uh, whatever that is well it's a lock we can see that but if it has a specific name i don't know anyway um and so it has a leather on the inside and i carried it all week it held up really good in terms of you know i don't know the carry the wear and tear whatever i felt like it was it's dual like it's not so like i didn't have to baby it i guess that's what i'm trying to say and I really just like how it dropped on my shoulder. And, um, yeah, I really didn't use this too much, to be honest with you. You know, but it's it's real nice. I mean, it, go, it slides up and down nice. Let's see. I'm trying to. I mean, there was no problem with it as far as cinching. Let me see if I can. 
I never had a problem with any of the Dooney and Burks, like, you know, the Cinchy. And that's a really cute silhouette, you know? This, I know people have had a problem with that. You know, but it's only been a week. Um, I'm definitely going to carry it again. Probably won't pull it out to the spring because it's sort of like a spring color. But you know what? I don't let that stop me. If I'm feeling, listen, this is my happy place. Okay, this is what I like doing. It's a hobby. It's a collection. Whatever you want to call it. I like it. So if I feel like, I don't care what season it is. I don't care if it's matching my, this is me. Don't judge me. Match my shoes or whatever. If I feel like carrying it, guess what? We carried it. So this is what I had last week. And I'm really kind of struggling to get out of it. Uh, but I, but I, I need to. Because... We have all these bags. We need to use them, right? So I figure, as I said, I've been doing one a week. So what I want to run, what I'm going to switch into is going to be a secondhand bag that I'm really happy with. Okay, so she was asking. Oh, excuse me. Sorry, I just got done eating, y'all. I ain't gonna lie. I've been on a fast, and when it's time to eat, <laughs> you know, I pretty much don't let anything stop me. But anyway, uh, she was. <laughs> She was selling it for, I promise you, like $190 if I'm not lying. I said, I'm not paying that much money, but I guess eBay can track when you're looking at something. So I just skipped by it. Then eBay, or maybe it was her, I don't know. Somebody came back and said, oop, drop my cap, hold on. Okay, sorry. Um, I said, come back and... um. Offer 119. I'm said, I'm thinking to myself, she not coming down the low. Mm -mm. All Florentine, and you can't buy it on the site. You can buy it secondhand. And other people who are selling it, you know, they they're they're like up in the two hundreds. She not coming down that low. Well, I said whatever. I I put in a bid for 120. Whatever. Checked it the next day when I woke up because you know I do that midnight shopping. Which I don't recommend for people. <laughs> Get in trouble doing that. Anyway, checked it the next day. And it said, congratulations, you won. I'm like, really? <laughs> well, right on there. So, <clears throat> it says pay now. So, I pay, blah, blah, blah. And I said, let me see what this bag looked like. The seller had 100%, you know, ratings on her reviews. Okay, so I'm going to say, okay. When he came, I was pleased. And I'm talking about... <clears throat> This Smith bag right here. I've never owned one. It reminds me of... Let's see if I got one handy. No, they're all put up pretty good. The, the Florentine Satchel. You guys know what I'm talking about. It reminds me a lot of that. And I have several of those. Uh, so I'm like... But because, you know, the price, one, 120 uh, And then, of course, I had to pay, like, some shipping and handling but that's that's typical and it looks like it was in such good condition the camera's not even lying and just as clean on the inside it has some pebbling up here i mean it like it's patina but on natural i like that i mean i don't care about that and uh the inside was just as clean let me see if i can show y'all real quick look at this it don't smell like smoke dog, cat, bird, nothing <laughs> it smells good I like, you know what, I need to go back on there I know it's important, ratings, I depend on ratings when I'm buying or looking to buy something, so I need to be diligent and go back and give good ratings not just when something didn't go right and i want to go off on somebody and get bad ratings because i will do that too but good ratings so anyway i need to go back and give her a good rating because this was exactly how she described it i see why she got you know people were saying good things about her but anyway what i was what got me um i want to say what started this whole thing was the chelsea East, West. Anyway, they have another bag similar to this, but it flares out on the sides and it has a pocket here. But anyway, I um, what attracted me 
was this pocket here. Okay, but I don't anticipate keeping my phone there because it has a pocket on the back, which, look at that. Let me see. Oh, look. Here's my case. That's not a problem right there. I like that. I really do because that's easy access, right? Un unlike which it doesn't take away from this bag, especially if you carry it cinched, you know, you always, it's going to be hard. And I, and I use my phone all the time. Like it's for everything, calendars, you know, uh, appointments, reminders, whatever, uh, texting, whatever. So this doesn't have any pockets on the outside. So you guys get it. Um, I didn't mind it for the week. You know, I just, as I said, I keep it open. I don't cinch it because I need to go in and out a lot. But this right here, pocket is nice on here. But let's say like if I wanted to keep it up front. I just don't want to do that extra step. I'll do this extra step for what would I keep in here. I don't know. Keys. I'll do extra step for keys. But I can even put my phone in there. See how it goes? Yeah. This is a Galaxy note 22 20 something 22 one of the big ones but anyway but doing that right there so most likely be like keys or work badge or something but here it's no problem and then in here is like your regular duty setup with the you know what they call it slip and zip i like this little i don't have a purse that has the uh let's see if i can show you you see this right here which I'll probably never utilize because to me that's doing too much. Like, who knows? Who cares, right? Um, but yeah, the regular duty setup. And then it kind of folds over. What is It's the Florentine satchel that um, I would, if I had it handy. You guys know what I'm talking about with the braided handle. Love those purses. And I don't even carry them that much. I don't know why. I guess because they are heavy. And uh, you got to be, you know, you got to get your mind right to carry one of those. You know what? Darn that. I'm going to show you. Hold on. Okay. Here's one. I haven't even carried this one. Uh, I think I showed you guys. If not, here you go. But these are so gorgeous to me. But I don't carry them that much because as I said... You got to, you know, you got to, I don't know, it's heavy. And then when I put all my stuff in it, because I'm like this, you know, some people are like, okay, they'll get a bag and it's like, well, I don't carry that much stuff in it, but that's why I got the big bag, right? Because I want all my stuff in it because I don't want to go for, you know, wanting for anything. So, but that's why I got the big bag. So like, I want it all, right? I want the cuteness. I want the big bag. I want to be able to put everything in there, but if it's going to be cute, most likely cute in my opinion. It's going to be something heavy because I love leather. But anyway, this is the uh, Florentine Satro. I haven't gotten to this yet. This uh, this thing, girls, probably, or guys, sorry, it's probably about two years old. Whatever. Whatever. This is my little, you know, we'll get to it. As I said, when I get it, get my mind straight. So anyway, this is the Florentine Smith bag. I mean, oh, I got to find some more of these things. But I think I'm going to move into this next week and wear it to work and see how it goes. Maybe I'll come back and tell you guys. Anyway, video getting long. I just wanted to share that with you guys. I hope you're having a blessed Sunday. I hope you got a chance to uh, spend some time with family because that's important. Uh, take care of yourself because that's most definitely important um, and today Sunday I went to the house of the Lord and worship God because for me that's everything not going per se to church I do do that but uh, you know acknowledging God and understanding that um, you know he's he's been good to me and uh, thanking him for that but anyway uh, I will talk with you guys again soon I don't know when, but who knows? Maybe uh, next Sunday I'll pop on here and tell you how it went with the Smith bag. So again, <clears throat> have a blessed week. I'm uh, 
they still got a lot of these still online second hand and a lot of them i looked at are in good conditions in different colors but if you want one and um you love the satchel the Florentine satchel you probably like this too it just doesn't have the the handles you know but this one is a good let's see look at this y'all almost almost but if you like this and you know this is what you feeling go and get you one all right have a good week bye